Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Stalker 2. Let's reload this bad boy. We don't have much ammo. This is all we have. We have knife, a pistol, and some bolts. Uh, the use of that you will see probably later. For now, let's stick with the pistol. This is one of the most anticipated games of uh, of the year, honestly. Big thanks to GSC Game World for giving me access to this game early. I'm really excited. This is probably, this game is just so immersive. I played the prologue, I skipped it for you in this video. First of all, I want you guys to play it for yourselves first. And I wanted to like get into the meat and potatoes of the game for the first time as my main video. You know, this is after the prologue. We got robbed of our stuff. We entered the zone for some reason. You'll see why. Now this game is massive. I think it's like 60 square kilometers without even counting the underground. And it takes like 40 hours to complete the main story. And if you take your time and, you know, explore stuff, it takes over 100 hours, which I really like. So if you're excited, please drop a like for the algorithm. Subscribe to the channel. And let me know down below if you want to see more of this game. Let's continue. Uh, I hear some gunshots. That's probably not that good. What do I hear? Oh, I see people over there. Now, are they friendly or not? What's this? Med kits and a bunch of stuff. Look at that, they are freaking fighting over there. I don't think they're friendly, I think I'm just gonna start shooting them. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, he already killed me. Oh. That was a nice headshot. But uh, we are gonna die if we don't bandage ourselves quickly. There's a guy inside. That's a friendly. Holy crap. What kind of gun did he have? Ah, he had a double barreled Sano shotgun. Well, of course. Of course, that does a lot of damage. I mean, look at this. Freaking boomstick. He has a grenade. He has some stuff. Where is their gun? It's another boomstick. He had a weapon. The Viper 5. What's that? Viper 5. Ah, oh, MP5. Okay. I'll take that. I doubt it has much ammo though. Continue scrolling. There we go. Yeah, oh, oh my goodness, only 10 bullets. Hello there. We saved this guy. You fucked them up pretty good, eh? <laughs> I didn't expect anyone to step in for me. That's rarer than Mama's beats around here. I might be pushing my luck here, but could you lend me a hand with something else? Of course, our first side mission. I'm listening. All right, let's hear it. You know what? I'm not even going to question it. We'll do it. All right, I'll do it. For real? Dude, you rock. Don't worry, I won't just send you there empty-handed. I've got a stash close by. Ooh, I like it's stash. Everything you need. A gun, some ammo, the whole shebang. Whatever you don't use, consider it yours. Just make sure you've got Gloomy's back, all right? All right, all right. Got it. Uh, let's go towards that stash. We can freaking loot these buildings, but I want that stash. Let's see the stash. Is it somewhere close by? I presume this is the stash. It is. There we go. Right over there. We'll check out this building later. Same for these buildings. I'm sure every single building in this game, because this game drips with immersion, every single building has something in it probably. Anyway, I presume this is the stash, the freaking down helicopter. Holy crap. I want to be careful. Some radiation here. No scary creatures around. Um. Yes, there is. I saw you, stupid dog. I'm scared. Let's quickly grab the stash. Oh, a bunch of stuff. Extra ammo for the MP5, that's good. Oh! Bastard. Stupid dog. Radiation is getting worse. I hear more. Oh! 
Oh my goodness, where the hell do these rabbit dogs come from? Those are pretty freaking powerful creatures. Bro, get out of here. Leave me alone. We got the stash. That's all I want. The mutants didn't get you, did they? Well, they almost they did. Try. Exactly, they did try. Stupid dog. Okay, we wasted all our ammo on those stupid dogs. But whatever. We got an MP5. Let's reload this thing. So let's see, our radiation is pretty high, which is not good, as you can see by the screen flickering. But we do have some anti-radiation stuff. Uh, let's see, what is... Apparently, we don't have anti-radiation stuff. That's not good. So let's quickly loot these buildings, because it is pretty high, and you take more damage the more exposed you are. I have a backpack here. Bread. I'll take everything, but we need some anti-radiation stuff. Would be cool if we can find it. My whole screen is freaking shaking. Also, we're low on health, so let's use the med kit. Anything here? A ladder. What will we find up here? Med kit, bandage, bandage. That's what we need. That is against the radiation. So let's drink this bad boy. You saw that in the bottom left? It all re got reduced substantially. That's good. Okay. Now. Let's save that guy's friend. Where do we need to go? I presume here. Dangerous visitor. Side mission. Sun is setting. I hear some... I hear some dogs, I think. This game is, like I said, it's immersive. There's the stupid dog. Come on. Gotcha. Okay, I presume this is the uh, boiler house where we need to go. And I also assume there are enemies nearby. Yep, we get to the boiler house. Now we need to save that gloomy guy. Let's do it before the sun goes down, actually. We are hungry, by the way, so let's quickly eat something. Who the hell eats while almost preparing for battle? Eat that sausage. Okay, that's good. Like I said, I all, I have played the prologue. And I can tell you one thing. Oh yeah, they're inside, that's for sure. I'm not gonna shoot them straight on. Let's get inside. Did he kill him? Let's do this. Okay, that didn't work. We're bleeding. That's a headshot, I think. Wow. Okay, this game is pretty difficult, but I think we got everybody. Yeah, we'll check that out later. First, let's search. Oh, that's him! Holy crap, you're scaring the hell out of me. What's up, dude? Well, who sent you? Richter or that asshole Zorik? Ooh, I can choose my reward. I have a detector already, so he will give me something else, but uh, we'll do this. That'll do. Hand it over. Here you go. There's an anomaly in the cave. Appeared right after the emission. Maybe the detector will help you sniff something out. Thanks for the help, stalker. But don't count on anyone standing up for you if you run into trouble. You'll be better off that way. Okay, mission right, accomplished. Stupid asshole! Get over here! Got some more ammo. Got a bunch of stuff here. What the hell is that? Pistol suppressor. Let's use the pistol because I'm pretty sure it's only available for the pistol. There we go. Pistol suppressor. Oh, you even have an animation for that. I like that. I like stuff like that. Hell yeah. Okay, now let's see. Let's go towards the main mission. Wait, there's something else here. It seems rather close by, but this map is huge, like I said. So, also, 
don't get me wrong, this game is beautiful and gorgeous, especially during the daytime, but it is so freaking scary. During the pro during the prologue, I had some jump scares, not gonna lie. What is inside here? What do we have? Interact. No, no, no. I want that on. The more light, the better. Med kit. Some stuff that we can use. Take everything. Magnetic cave. I like the fact that you have those locations marked with a um, question mark, obviously. And then it's just a location. It doesn't necessarily have to mean anything. Just maybe some loot and stuff like that. Let's continue towards the uh, main mission. I mean, look how dark it can get. It is completely dark. It is pitch black. That is crazy. That is actually crazy. Okay. Oh, you see that? That is an anomaly. So what we can do is we're going to use the bolt... And see, this is, like we need to navigate through it. This is the like the edge, so you can walk through there. The edge is right there as well, so we need to be very careful. Okay, just straight on. I like the uh, ambient soundtrack in the background. I think it's really cool, really fitting. Those sounds, what the hell is, hey, what's that? This game is filled to the brim with stuff. What's this? I like a med kit. Thank you. It's like a little altar or something. Yep. Thank you for the med kit, Jesus. If we drop from here, we'll break our legs. We'll go around. Oh! Holy crap, these are friendly. Jeez. Look at that. They, they just got back from a, uh, from a trip or something like that. Okay, so these are friendly. Obviously indicated by the green cross here. Strangers with guns at the ready aren't welcome in the zone. Hide your weapon, use H. Got it. Okay, our first village in Stalker 2. Nice little roadblock here. My goodness. Hello there. I'm a friendly. I'm looking for Zalicia. And in the meantime, if you have some stuff that I can steal and loot from you, I'll happily do that. Definitely inside this building. Hello? I'm looking for Sauter. Nope. Talk to Gaffer. That's him over there. What do you want? Looks like the cutscenes are uh, a little bit. Sit down and stay out of sight. Looks like the cutscenes have a lot of frame drop, unfortunately. Three of my men never reported back from their overnight patrol around the lesser zone. We found their bodies by the old bridge. Hey, soldier, over here. What do you call three dead wardens up the zone's ass? A good start. <laughs> <laughs> you basically threw your pistol at him. That's traitor. It's not intimidating. Hamster. He's peddling this service weapon. It belonged to one of those wardens. He got it from Squint. Apologies, Captain, but Zalicia is a free trade zone. We have an agreement with Korshinov. Where is Squint? The zone has its share of secrets. Who are we to meddle in its designs? Who am I to judge? Who am I to judge? If you won't tell me, others will. Seize them! Easy now. Nobody's going anywhere. If you don't want the innocent to suffer, find me the culprit. For some reason, I have a feeling that I have to do that. You know, when a game has this kind of atmosphere, for me, it's already like... It's hard to explain, but for me, that's already like 50% game completed, you know what I mean? I, I love when a game has this kind of atmosphere. I mean, look at this. Listen to the rain. Look at the environment. Look at the aesthetics. Amazing. Anyway, enough of that. What do we have to do? What do we have to do? There's a side mission here. Let's go there. We need to find that valid guy in the water tower. No music, just the sound of the rain. That is impressive. I like it. Oh, I'm feeling really cozy. <laughs> Some of you gamers know what I mean. This is the kind of game that you can get lost in for hours and just, you know, just spend your entire weekend from dusk till dawn playing this game. Find Valak. By the water tower. Screw you. Screw you all. Come on. Who's 
gonna be first? Not me. Shut up, you pussy. This sucker screwed you out of your money. That doesn't sound too good. Oh, friendly. Friendly. Hey, you! Loner! Come and help some good fellows. Make yourself useful. You know what? They are with multiple people and they have big guns, so I should listen. Chill the hell out already. I got it. Oh, there he is. Who's there? I'm gonna shoot! Easy there. I just want to talk. Are you nuts, man? I'm kind of busy here, you know? If I drop my guard for a second, these thugs will do me in. If I'm going down, I'm taking at least one of them with me. You owe money to Warlock. Are you kidding me? Fine, get in line. It's not like you can kill me twice. You want me to pay him back? All right, listen up. The stash is at the water tower, at the very top. You'll know what to do once you're up there, hopefully. Don't get into an anomaly on the way. Whoa, he's spilling the beans. Are you scared of heights, Loner? Nah, I don't give a damn. Get up to the tower and grab the stash. Bro, who do you think you are? I'm going to the top of the tower, don't get me wrong, but don't think you can keep the stash, that's mine. Stupid Valux or whatever your name is. Pretty easy to see the anomalies right here. I can walk between this thing, right? Up the water tower I go. There we go. <laughs> I like the uh, I like this kind of game world. This overgrown kind of post-apocalyptic world. I like it. I like it a lot. And it doesn't it's not over the top if that makes sense. There it is. Stash up here. You guys couldn't figure it out to get up here? Of course, it's on the top of a tower. There's always something here. Look at this place. Amazing. Let's look. Oh! Holy crap, that's mine. That is mine. I'm not gonna give it to them. Okay. Got it. I'm gonna take them out. I'm gonna take them out. Hold breath. First I'm gonna take that's the that's the main guy, right? I'm gonna take him out first. I don't know why I'm trust I trust him. These guys that threatened me right off the bat, so I'm gonna take them out. How much health do these guys have? Okay, so I messed it up, like always. There is at least still two people alive, I think. Or at least one. What happens if I do this? The thing oh, there he is! Got him. I think they're all dead now. I guess uh, we're gonna find out now. That's Dima. Just killed him with a nice little headshot, as you can see. Too bad I didn't kill the others in a clean way. I'm screwed. Either I pay off all my debts, or I gotta leave the lesser zone for good. Yeah, you do. You gotta pay up, buddy. Thank you, Stalker. I owe you one. Pay up. Pay up your debt to Warlock first. He promised me a cut. Ah, uh, well... I was going to pay him back, honest. Now? Fair enough, that's the right thing to do. Done. I sent the coupons, both yours and Warlock's. Okay. That's better. Come in. I just got money from Valley Clumax. Tell the little shit I said hi. Maybe I'll pour one for him later if you won't be an asshole. <laughs> anyway, thank you, sucker. Out. Ah, uh, that's a shame. 900 coupons. I'm not going that's back that's a time. lot. I more than doubled my uh, my total. Okay, enough of that. Let's go back to our main objectives. Which is... There's a stash here. An old cache. And there's some stuff here as well. 
You know, before we go back towards the main objective, first I want to check this stash out. I don't know if it's a good idea to stay on the road or to venture off. I guess we'll find out. That's an anomaly. It's gone for a couple of seconds now, so I can pass. I like exploring, but this is game is scary as hell, bro. Let's use the shotgun. It's close quarters, you never know. Radiation, gotcha. Let's use this thing. That's maximum uh, radiation reduction. So that should help. Where's the stash? There's a freaking anomaly right there. That is scary. That is super scary. Look at that. That is crazy. There's another anomaly right there. Loads of anomalies. All that for some stash? Am I close though? Yeah, I'm, I'm really close. Seven meters. Oh, there it is! I was right on it. Okay, that's a decent stash. Take everything. Oh, I'm really heavy. We need to sell some stuff ASAP. How the hell do we get out of here? How do we get out of here now? Walk past this thing. Walk past the anomaly. Oh, what have I got myself into? There's another one right here. You can almost... How do I get out of here? Okay, you can walk straight through here. Hey, stalker! That's my bro over there! Bring me his body, okay? Where? What are you talking about? I don't see anybody. Oh, there! That's him! That's Bob's! Bring him over here! And no robbing the dead, okay? Show my bro some respect. Okay. It's getting... It's getting red. Who are you? That's a friendly, okay. Um, I will search him. Goldfish, that's worth a lot. I have a feeling I should not steal this. So I'm not going to. I will pick up the body as that guy requests. Okay, we can move straight on. I understand now. This is basically just a way to navigate through the anomalies, the bulls. Okay. Yes. Hey there. Put him down. There you go. How about toast to my bro? Hey, rest in peace. Or, where's my payment? What about my payment? Give me a sec. Thanks for getting Bob's out of there. 850 coins or now. coupons. I need some time alone. That's personal. Okay, I'm show gonna some do respect. something really okay. scummy. He says show some respect, but I'm gonna steal from him anyway. You dead man. Yep, I knew it. That's my mistake, guys. And now I probably have like bad karma or something and I will get the bad ending. Bro, I just wanted a goldfish. That's all I wanted. That's it. Goldfish received. Examine the artifact. Look at that. What is that? Maybe I did good. Let's get back to the main mission. Let's get back to the main mission. Look at this freaking world, bro. It looks gorgeous. Play this game in the dark with the lights off and you'll have a good time. Also a very scary time, but a good time. Look, my stamina is getting reduced very quickly because I'm overweight. <laughs> At least when it comes to the stuff that I'm carrying. What the hell are those things? What the hell is that? What? Holy! Holy! Oh! Oh, leave me alone! Please leave me alone. Leave me alone. Oh! What is going on? What the? Get on top here, get on top here, get on top here. I'm sure you can climb the ladders. What the hell was that? What is that? 
Oh, and it's also starting to get dark. Is he gone? It's a freaking invisible thing. How the hell do you beat that? What the hell? Look at that. That is crazy. I'm out of here. I'm not even gonna try to mess with that thing. I think I'm, I'm, th I think I'm being haunted. My compass is glowing red. Holy crap. No, no, no. This is not good. I need some vodka quickly. Is that vodka? I need some vodka, man. Okay, looks like I'm in the clear. Let's get back towards the um, safe zone because that was way too scary. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna end it here. My heart is uh, pounding out of my chest. Uh, this game is terrifying. It is crazy, good, beautiful, but also terrifying. Can't wait to play more. Let me know down below if you want to see more. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And with that being said, I see you guys next time.